Hello guys, this is Alexander Rezar and uh, in today's video I am going to show you how the air filters look after uh, approximately 4000 kilometers and also how much uh, oil we have accumulated in the oil catch can. This is the oil catch can, uh, I'll present it to you afterwards but first I, I just want to show you exactly how the air filters look after 4000 kilometers. Be mindful that uh, the reason for which I've installed the catch can is to reduce the amount of uh, oil particles which are being pushed through the inlet manifolds. That is done in order to avoid accumulation of soot in the intake manifolds because the EGR system pushes the unburned gases from the diesel and the oil vapors combined with the unburned gases of the diesel will uh, form soot in the intake manifold. So we've reduced uh, this phenomenon. Right now I need to show you exactly how the air filters look. What I'm gonna do right now is this is a clean paper towel just ripped it off and this is from the right air box. As you can see there is not there is something but not some alarming uh, amount of oil particles see there is something and let's take the clean side see the clean side right here we are going to try and clean the bottom side for where the air is being sucked into the inbox uh, the air boxes thing is the oil vapors are heavy and they will not travel so easily upwards up the stream so basically what they, they do over time is accumulate on the bottom side of the air box like shown here you see of course we have some uh, oil gases which travel to the air filter themselves Now, obviously, you can see which is new and which is old. You can see through it. You can barely see through it after 4,000 kilometers. There's a lot of dust and other accumulations. But uh, in my opinion, it's much better to change air filters. Let's say not every 2,000 kilometers, but let's say every three, four thousand, five thousand kilometers. But I'll stick to three and a half thousand kilometers. This is the rear side. And this is the new one. So yeah, we do have some uh, oil vapors going into the intake, but very little compared to what we've had before okay I'm gonna put this aside for bugs and stuff I'm gonna rip another clean towel you see and this is the other side of the air box we want to see how it is a bit contaminated but nothing to be scared of so this is just after 4000 kilometers bear in mind that I drive very hard the, the car I rarely sees economical driving I always uh, get very high fuel consumption because of my tendency to drive very very fast so let's see one more time this is it so this modification it's up to you if you want to do it think of it this way you put uh, much more stress on the air filters as opposed to putting much more stress on the intake manifolds uh, swirl flaps and also the um, 
the DPF, of course, that's the main part. What we are trying to avoid is that suit accumulation, which leads to improperly burnt fuel and uh, faster clogging up of the DPF. My opinion, it's a, uh, it's the best compromise. What you what you can do in order to enjoy the vehicle as much as possible. Right. Of course, that's for the left side, the, the right side. This is the left side. As you can see, it's covered in dirt. You see, that's the difference. So, air filters are still in one piece, intact. They don't suffer from any damage due to exposure of oil. So you can be uh, with ease of heart and do this modification. If you will, of course, if you wanna do it, it's not mandatory to do it. You can do whatever with your vehicle. Good. So now I think it's time to, to show you how much soot or how much uh, oil we've accumulated after 1000 kilometers I, I tend to drain the oil catch can each 1000 kilometers okay let me do it another way so we have this clean bottle And basically this is just water and oil particles combined. See, just a bit, but mostly that's water because oil and air condensation oh you get the idea right now we have another clean rag and let's see what we get on the bottom of the oil catch can My vehicle right now has 230,000 kilometers. I'm gonna state it once more. I've installed the oil catch can at around 226,000 kilometers. And the main benefit which I saw is that the DPF regenerations are now done at around 350 to 400 and something kilometers. So at a normal rate, in my opinion. Sorry if you can't see anything, but it's spick and span, it's cleaned. 
let me unwind this. You see? Good. Guys, I thank you for watching this video. Uh, hit the like, share and subscribe buttons and uh, see you in the next video. Goodbye.